So this is going to be your last call. This is, we're going to be looking at Ada, Zer, and Eververse to see what you guys are going to be missing out if you guys don't pick it up now. So if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe. Other than that, let's just get into it. So for Ada, you're going to miss out on Sato Tribe, one of the best shaders in the game by far. Definitely a really good shader. Definitely you're going to regret this if you don't get it. To be fair, I'm pretty sure Ada has like a set uh, list of shaders that she's going to be selling. So this will probably come out in the future again. But do you really want to risk it, especially since it might come out like not the next season, but the season after or the season after that. So just pick it up. It's only 10,000 bright or glimmer. It's not that expensive. New Pacifica Rush. I would only pick this up if you're interested in getting a lot of the shaders in the game because this is an old one. This is from Titan. So I would recommend this one just because might as well. And then you Monarchy Regalia. We've gotten this one twice or three times this season. I would say pick this one up just because it's such a good gold and uh, red shader. Definitely an Iron Man shader if you want to go for that as well. Uh, for the armor sets, I'm not going to show them all again, but it's basically all of the... Actually, I can just do this real quick. So for the cloaks and, and marks and bonds, I'm not going to show that off again. If you guys do want to see me go through all of the armor that she's uh, selling, you can check out my Ada video because that's where I, well, I go through all of it because it is quite a bit of stuff but for the armor itself specifically the uh the uh, scorn pieces it's gonna be these right here so it's gonna be the scorn baron vest and the nia thonis breather these two are not that great in my opinion the warlock one however is really good specifically the chest piece the scorn baron robes is really good the element whatever the fuck how you ever say this is not great but the chest piece for this one immaculate definitely pick this one up it's super cool or titans it's gonna be the it's here no it's not it's factions was it factions that we saw that? no it's world world uh it's over here scorn baron plate i think it's pretty cool as well and remember titans you guys do have a scorned ornament for the uh the exotics that turn your shield into like the sh the one you shoot through titan's ramparts that one you do have a really cool one so if you are interested to do a like a really cool uh scorned look you can definitely do that and then you have like a black panther inspired helmet which i'm not the biggest fan of this helmet but i mean if you're interested there it is um that's pretty much it for ada again there are there are other marks she is selling the memory of Cade mark cloak and bond which is really cool definitely pick it up for the titans but for the other two they're just pretty generic as for Zer, again i've already done a Zer video you guys can check it out right here but the armor set is going to be the Lightkin stuff. It's really, really good. Uh, definitely pick up some of these pieces. Chess piece for the Hunters and Titans and Warlocks. The chess piece are so good for all of them. The arms as well for all of them. And the difference here would probably be the, the cloak for the Hunter is really good. Um, Titan, I don't think anything else is pretty good. And then the Warlocks, I think the boots are really good. And the Bond is really good. Bond? I don't even remember the bond off the top of my head. Yeah, actually, the bond is really good as well. If I remember correctly, it's that really cool, like, uh, like cloth texture. Uh, I don't have the armor sets in front of me right now, so <laughs> I apologize. But if I remember correctly, it's through seasons. Uh, no, it's over here. Yeah, it's this one's really, really cool. Definitely pick this one up as well. It is very like minimal, but it is really, really cool. So yeah, ever, or, or, but yeah, uh, Zer has some really cool things available. For weapons, we have True Prophecy with Opening Shot and Rampage, which is pretty good. Grid Skipper with Killing Wind and High Impact Reserves, which is also pretty good. Farewell with Full Auto Trigger System and Adrenaline Junkie, essentially one perk on this. Ikelos has some, or Ikelos Shotgun with Grave Robber and Trench Barrel, which is okay. For, uh, far, far Future, Quick Draw Frenzy. I don't like Frenzy on a sniper rifle. Who Scout with Snapshot Sights and Quick Draw, which is interesting because it was this would be pretty fun to use in pvp uh take your take your weapon out really fast and aim it although some people would argue why would you aim it when you can just shoot it but i would i like to aim when i shoot my shit. uh night watch with subsistence and moving target for the exotics we have hawk moon with opening shot and then dead man's tail with subsistence which actually is pretty fun uh for the exotics crimson which is pretty cool definitely annoying hopefully no one picks this up because i don't want to see this shit anymore bombardiers ashen wake and wings of sacred dawn 
As for Eververse, I don't remember off the top of my head what she's selling because it has been a week. Golden Age Wine is a pretty good shader. I actually do like the shader quite a bit. Um, if it ever loads. So this is actually a pretty cool shader, especially with this helmet. That purple comes out really good. Yeah, it's a pretty good shader. Um, I know I'm not a big fan of purple and yellow, but this is actually pretty good. Uh, we have Rivalry White Sand, which is a cool shader. I actually really do like this shader. Uh, not so much the cloth, the gold cloth, but with like armor, it actually looks really cool. And then we have, ooh, photo finish. That's right. So if you guys are interested, actually, hold on, let me see. So I did change my armor just to showcase photo finish because again, photo finish is such a unique shader. You guys can see it basically gives you RGB lighting on your glows. So definitely pick this up this is a shader that is only available through guardian games so if you don't pick this up now today is the last day you're going to be able to pick this up because once this is over you're going to have to wait another year so for those who have been interested in getting the rgb lighting make sure to pick this up we have up for grabs which is a yeah this one's the mcdonald's shader <laughs> it's yeah it's the only one like but I, i'm loving it that's literally what i think about when i see this shader we have pre Reef Made, which is not a good shader in my opinion. I honestly, I, I don't know what it is. I think it's like the color of the purple, maybe, or or it's probably like the pink color with the purple. I don't know what it is. I'm just not the biggest fan of it. And then Verdant Chrome, which is from the Revelry, which is an old event, probably showing my age there. Not age, but like how much, how long I've been in this game with, because Revelry was a long time ago. So yeah, nothing too crazy aside from photo finish for Eververse. I think photo finish is definitely something you're going to want to pick up. So that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Which, what are you guys going to be picking up? I definitely think photo finish is definitely worth a pickup because that's a pretty good shader with uh, RGB lighting. Um, I also think some of the shaders that Ada is selling is also really worth it. So again, make sure to pick those up. Don't tell me I didn't warn you because this is the reason why I started making these last call videos because people kept telling me, oh, I need to get this. I need to get that. So. This is your last call. Make sure to pick this up. Be safe. I will see you guys later.